We're ready to establish the base course of an outside curve with reinforcement. For more information about establishing the radius, please refer to the outside curve section. Dig the trench and install the leveling pad using best practices. Most retaining walls are designed assuming 100% coverage of the reinforcement. When building an outside curve, the block edges of the reinforcement will have gaps, so the back edges of the reinforcement won't overlap. The best way to reach 100% coverage is to use additional lengths of reinforcement to fill those gaps on the next course of blocks. Cut reinforcement to the length specified in the wall plan. Lay sections of reinforcement within one inch of the face of the wall, making sure the strength direction of each section is perpendicular to the wall face. Avoid overlapping. Place the next course of block marking the back of each block to identify areas that are unreinforced. This step is important because once a course is backfilled, it's impossible to find the unreinforced gaps. Backfill and compact. Using the marked blocks as a guide, place subsequent sections of reinforcement to overlap the gaps left on the previous course. This will ensure total reinforcement coverage. Repeat this procedure throughout the construction of the radius curve when reinforcement is required. 